Hello everybody, my name is Markiplier and welcome to Blameless, a free horror game available on Steam that supposedly is very good. But I say that for I'm a lot of these games. Freelance, so I take job offers as they arise. So, when this guy called me, I was relieved I could finally get a paying job. He said he needed help with interior design for his house that he was building. I always respected people who could do construction, so I naturally agreed to come and take a look. I already had a couple of ideas. It was already quite late, but he insisted on me coming over the same day. I tried to comply, because I didn't want to lose this offer. I drove there with my car. His house was all the way over in the suburban area, quite remote, but with other houses nearby, quiet place. The man met me at the front gate. It was a temporary fence, and the gate was made of rotting wooden planks. He started showing me around the yard. It seemed weird that there was a large garbage container blocking the way, so we had to go through the garage to get inside the house. He took me through the rooms, so I started looking around. At one point, I saw a stain, and at first glance it seemed like brick dust. But then I realized it was blood, spilled on the floor. I thought that maybe there was another worker who got injured, so I turned to tell the man. That's when I saw his hand raised to hit me. He was holding a metal rod. Oh. Before I could defend myself, he hit me in the head. Oh, jeez. must have passed out. I don't know how long I was out. <sighs> when I woke up. Perhaps there's going to be some interesting twist to this, because I imagine... I don't know, at first I thought this was going to be a fixer-upper house. Yeah, that hurt. Maybe you should be a little more concerned at the fact that someone tried to murder you. Or maybe it was your own blood and you were just seeing it in the future. Oh, this looks lovely. Oh, this uh, I can't move my mouse anymore! Oh, there we go, okay. Well, we just had a little hiccup, but apparently so it seems to be going. This bloodstain okay. does not look like it's a result of a banal injury. Are you talking about a banal injury? Alright, so why- oh, hello. I might be able to get further through the attic. Why would you be able to do that? Just bash your way out of the- Windows Gangnam style. I mean, they don't seem too sturdy. I mean, everything does seem to be falling apart. Also, I don't know why you came all the way out of here just to be murdered. Oh, I've got a weapon now. Habuski! I can't whack? Oh, shit. Give me that. I probably need this for some reason or another. Ooh. Okay, I don't know why I'm doing this, but I need to do it apparently. Doink! Okay. I should bend the rod. But it's too tough to do by hand. Oh, you mean you're a little baby wimpy baby? Can't bend it with your own muscles? Come on, man. All right, so I gotta find some. Hello, hello, nine one one. Uh oh, well, that don't look too good. The phone is smashed. No way it's gonna work anytime soon. Well, then why do I have it? I mean, it's a Nokia. It should last forever. Okay, so I got an inventory here. Ugh. A lot of dust flowing from the ceilings, which isn't a good sign. Oh, so this game is like, ooh. <gasps> Can I use this pipe to bend the rod? I don't know how I'd be able to do that, but I'm gonna try. Hello? Kerchunkles! Oh! That works weirdly well! That was ingenuitiveness. Okay, so now I just gotta... Then I can take it? Well, now I've got a bent rod. I sure can't beat the shit out of anybody that wants to hit me with a metal rod. Pull this open. Hell yeah. Well, that sounded really scary. So what's up here? Hello? Oh, I hate poking my head in an attic. I can't see what's behind me, so might as well get up. Uh. Shit, it's dark. Yeah, no joke, it's dark. Suck it up and move along. Oh boy. That doesn't seem good. Okay. What I hope- was that? I hope it was thunder, I was just about to say. There we go. Yeah, there we go, what do we go? What are you talking about? Where are we going? I don't know where we're going, what are you doing? There ain't nothing else up here. Geronimo! Okay! What do do? Is that my wallet? Can I- Is that- is that mine? Hello? Let's see. A library card belonging to Helen Woodward. Mm. How did get here? I don't like that. 
Can I do anything else about that? Or was that the- literally I picked the right card to pick up because apparently there's nothing else here because nothing else would have a name on it. Okay! Someone's being murdered in this place! That's no bueno. Ooh, that's no bueno. Okay, so am I gonna be murdered next? Ooh. That seems bad. What is this? It's holding the wires. Oh. So I need a wire cutter? And then I need a wood cutter? Or maybe I just need to sack up and shoulder that door open! Alright, so there's gotta be something- Oh, hello! Hi, crowbar! I'll be with you in just a second. Oh! A bolt! Good? Can I take another, or do I only need one? It's stuck underneath the beam. Well, it can't be that stuck, it's a crowbar! Use it to leverage the beam up! Hold the whole building open! Okay. Kerchon goes- Oh, oh. Uh. Uh, I don't know what benefit that did, but it didn't do a whole lot. I'll take this instead, and I'm gonna- I'm gonna break all the wires open, and no one's gonna stop me. It's- it's over this way. Herbert- the wire cutters are broken. What?! The hinge on that handle should attach, but it's missing. Okay, so I gotta go back, I gotta put it on the bench, I gotta put a nut in the bolt. I get it, I see this, I see this. Okay, so I need- first things first, I need- Ooh, maybe I can like, yeah, I can place this. Yeah, just like that. Okay, and then I could chunkles this up. Oh, so I am gonna lift the house. Hooray! And then I can open the door. Her bug be. Oh, I thought I had that. Come on, tell me I'm smart. Maybe I can kerbungles these off. Uh. Okay. Let's work. Oh! Well then, what were the wires doing? Were the wires doing anything? Ooh, it's outside. How about I just hop the fence and get the fudge out of here? Did I see something over there? Hang on, I- My brain was like... Analyzing- Hello? Hi. Hey! Shit. Okay. Sorry, that was a bit of an overreaction for that situation. I apologize. I'll try to contain my shit next time and heed my own advice and sack the fuck up. Anybody here? Hi. Hello. How are you doing? I'm fine. Thank you for welcoming to your home. Me, by the way. Not welcoming anybody, welcoming me. Okay, hello. Kerchunkles. So that doesn't work. And I abandoned some wire cutters. For some reason. Don't know why. And I didn't need it. Okay. Hello. Okay. Hello. I don't like the look of that dark corridor. Me neither! Let's see if the light switch is working. No, let's sprint down it! Ah! Okay. Everything is as it should be. I can't see a goddamn thing. Why am I in here? Can I open the windows? No, I cannot. I shouldn't be here. I should be running away. Hey, this doesn't work. That's good to know. Oh, this one doesn't have a light switch. Why is any part of this house finished? Where did they get this murder home? Murder apocalypse. Ooh. So, there's nothing here. There was no point to this. Oh, this one. Oh! Yeah, I could have done that at any time. At any moment I could have done that, and I did, I did it the stupid way. And I vastly apologize. Okay. What is that? That is nothing. What is this? Also nothing. What is this? Ooh! Ah! Oh! Yes? No? Did it- Why is it pointed up? Why is it pointed directly up? It see it seems to be working, but- I don't th Okay, but anyway, I got it, I suppose. It's working enough. Maybe pointing up so I get ambiance lighting and not so directional, maybe? Oh well, that was a cheerful... Cheerful change. Okay, anyway, so we got the flashlight. Ooh, hello. Ah. I couldn't have opened that any creepier. Oh! Finally uh, out of the house. Yeah, am I free? Can I go now? CAN I GO NOW?! Why do I need to run? I hate it when you tell me why I need to run! 
When you tell me I need to run, it's usually a bad thing. Locked. Yeah, it's locked. Why is it locked? Why would it be locked? Why is it be? Ow! I'm bashing the flashlight into my chin. Okay. Guess I don't need this here. Hello. Is anybody home? Also, how the hell do I get out of here? Is that a dead body? No, that's just plants. Can I go up here? No. Can I go here? No. How about it through these doors? No. This one? No. How about through here? Yes. Anybody? Hello? More dark rooms. Hell yeah. I love dark rooms. Dark rooms are the best. Because when I walk into dark rooms, I get to punch people in the face. Why is everything always locked? Because it's a murder house, you idiot! Me, idiot! You, me, everybody, he, she, we, idiot! Why is everything always locked? <sighs> okay, so this is locked. I gotta find something for that, or I could go back and get the crowbar, but that'd be just goddamn ridiculous. Oh, yeah. Okay. Can I go in here? Hello? Hi! Oh, let me- let me move these! Let me move these, cause I'm a smart. I'm one of the smarts. Okay, boink. Hello, hello, hello. Hi. Should I lock myself in here? Oh, I can't. Okay, never mind then. What's that? Hello. Okay. Hello. Is that a banana? Broken. Okay. Let's see. Dear Mr. Hopkin, this is to inform you that according to our records, as of July 12, 2001, we still haven't received back the scaffolding or the three suspension ladders you borrowed from the Dare Drew Constructions. Please return. They'll be solely your responsibility. Anna Catwell. 13 July oh, 2001. Why don't I just read that. I get it. I get it. I get it. But there's something behind me? Okay. So. Is there something else? Here. Okay, so I know what I need to do. I need to find, according to that letter, there's three total. There's one already on that scaffolding. There's one broken in the office. And then I just need to find another one somewhere around here before I get horribly stabbed in the butt. I mean, I don't think there's a good way to get stabbed in the butt, every as far as I know. Locked. But, you know, probably not. Not too many good ways. Oh, I bet it was back. If I go back, uh... I bet it was somewhere back. I could probably take it because I remember using a ladder somewhere. Or did I use a No, that was the, the elevator. Or the attic. The elevator. Ugh. Oh, whoa, what hey, whoa, hell? whoa, hey, hey. Hey, hey, how's it going? How's it going there? You just taking a nap, please? Shit, she's. She's dead. Yeah, oh, hey. I should have turned the lights on in here. I didn't see anything. It's dust. It's dust. I don't want to look at her face. Why not? <sighs> okay. She have keys? Yeah, she has keys, doesn't she? <sighs> oh, hi! The address of this house. Was she invited here too? Yeah, to work on the light and the water. She didn't do a very good job. Okay, so I got two keys. That's handy. Okay, goodbye now. Oh, no. Why didn't I check this place more thoroughly? I was stumbling around in the dark. I probably stepped on her. Ugh. Ugh. Okay. Well. She's dead, and then they're gonna kill me! Oh my god! Okay, so I need to get the key out of here. One of these for this. Ha boink! Okay, good. Going in. I'm gonna assume that was ghosts running away screaming from me, cause I'm so scary. Oh, this sounds like death. This is the way out. Is it? Is it now? I is this the way out? Oh, you, you think? You think this is the way out? Okay. Oh good, a hacksaw! Or a table saw! To chop- Hi? Okay. Alright. Nice barrels. Can I jump up you? Woo! It's a suspension loader! I can't jump up you, but I bet I can get up there with the Sumbomban Joder. Okay, I've got a Sambarambo Mober. I'll just put the Sumblamo Kadoder on here. Huffwumbles! 
I did it! But first I'm gonna go see if this key works on the back lock and I don't know why it would be locked back there! Or why she would have the key in her... hands. Oh no, wait, it's all gone. Okay, so... Oops, what did I do? Okay. Oops. Okay. I'm gonna- I'm gonna take this nut for safety. Then go up this ladder. I don't have any more keys. Okay. Scootaloodaloodaloop. Bootaloodaloop. I'm up. Okay. Ah. Why? 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 Am I free? Am I free? <laughs> hey! Fuck you! Fuck! I can't see! The fuck am I doing? Get away from me! Get away! Ugh, get away! Get away! Get, get away! Ah! Nyeh. What? No! Oh, what the fuck are you doing? What there the fuck? This is like water police. Stay where you are. I didn't do shit. You're under arrest. No, I'm not. I've get got a flashlight. But I didn't do anything. Get on your knees now. Are under arrest. Oh, am I? You didn't read me my Miranda rights. Well, what the hell? This is what happened. He was chasing me with a rod in his hand. He must have hidden when he saw the police cars pulling up to the gate. Uh huh. Mr. Malcolm, we searched the yard thoroughly and didn't find any evidence suggesting there was another man. No, 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 no. He was there. He was the owner who called me. The former owners sold the house due to personal financial problems two weeks ago. They moved to a different town on the other side of the country. The private company who owns it now proved all their employees were off-site, having a team building activity that night. How could you not find evidence of him? I'm telling you, he was there. I heard you. Our officers got a phone call from one of the neighbors reporting lights coming on in the house and suspicious person moving on site. They gave us your description. They never saw another man. How could that be? This doesn't make any sense. Let's I... cut the crap. What? It does make pretty clear sense to me. I have to say that I honestly don't believe any part of your bullshit story that you're giving me here. Everything suggests that you murdered that woman. No, I... You found the victim's blood on your clothes and your hands. You had the victim's wallet in your pocket. Wait. And the officers caught you fleeing the crime scene. You. No one else. Guess whose fingerprints match the ones we found on the victim's body? Huh? I don't know why you murdered that woman. But I'll guarantee you're never getting out. You're going down, Mr. Blameless. Ah, oh, I get it. Okay, I see now. Well, ain't this a conundrum? How do we know we can't trust this guy? Or maybe there was another way to play where you could, like, piece more things together. Were there more than one ending to that? Because I, I, I didn't have to pick up the wallet. That was just something that I picked up. So maybe, maybe there's like another ending. Oh, I love the... The smooth jazziness of this outro here really counteracts all the fun times we were having in the site there. Yeah, this is how I dance. When I'm at the club, crunking it up. That's how it all began for me. And it was far from over. What? What does that mean? What do you mean by that? What do you mean? Okay, hang on, I gotta see something about this because I am confuzzled. So I just found out there was like a completely different way to play that. I I want to go back in because I'm very very curious. Where's it gonna leave off if I continue? Oh, hi. Jesus! Ah! 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 Ow! <laughs> My face. Why did you do that to me? There's choices in this to make things work in different ways, and I'm wondering if there's a different ending to be got because I'm gonna show you right now. That you can like right away do different things and and like uh, that's why I was so confused because you had the copper pipe that you could bend it with but also if you look right in here oh never mind it's doing some in here there is a hammer I didn't know that there was a hammer in that one I thought I saw something else in the walkthrough okay well never mind there's oh there's something else in there there are like what do you do with this. 
What do you do with the hammer? What do you do with the hammer? Okay, so, like, I don't have to pick up that wallet. I, I really don't. I don't have to pick up the flashlight. It's not needed. It's not even beneficial. But what I can do is I can go over here, pick up this, pick up the pliers, and maybe I'll be just a little bit quieter about that, but... And then you can move this, and then take this and put it in there. There you go. Whoops. And then you've got- Whoa, I have fucked that up, haven't I? Well, I- Do they work? Hey, they work! And then you just break it without causing any noise. And then hopefully, you can get out of here all stealth-like. See, I didn't grab the wallet. I didn't grab none of that. Whoa. Shit. I know, right? Super scary. Is everything always lost? Well, why don't you just stop bitching and because I got a solution. Ooh, it dark. Anything useful here? I don't know. What's this? I don't know. Ah, I believe this thing can open fuse boxes. Okay. How about- Oh, the bo oh, the box! Oh, okay. Anything else in there? Not that I can tell. Hey! Yay! Oh, hello. RCD240. Test monthly. This switch looks important. Okay. RC these these are already on. These are all these are already these are all these are these are these are these are oh, already hello. on. Honey, if the circuit trips again, first turn the RCD switch, the smallest one, then the rest of them, the orange one last. Make sure the first here you first hear a click after you turn the RCD. It may take a couple of seconds, otherwise it will trip again. I need to take a look at this before we hand the keys to the new owner. Okay, so first the RCD, hear a click. May take a couple seconds. Okay, so... RCD2... RCD240. Test monthly. This switch looks important. Okay, so do something about it. There's gotta be a way that I can, like... That I can, uh... Oh, but I can't open this anymore. Locked. Well then, what the hell? What was the point of all that? Why did I need to do that? What's gonna trip? Nothing's gonna trip. There was nothing to trip. Oh man, it was worth a shot. I think I'm stuck. I, I might not have gotten something that I needed from before, but I can't open the garage door now. And I can't open the garage. I, I feel like it's connected there somewhere, but I just don't know the answer to it. So I'm gonna leave this here. So thank you everybody so much for watching. If you want to try and find an answer to this, uh, you can play the game for yourself. It's totally free. So I'll put a link down in the description below. So thank you everybody so much for watching. And as always, I will see you in the next video. Bye-bye!